So the reason why the healthcare ecosystem is committed to not only reducing but preventing hospital readmissions is that it not only costs taxpayers $17 billion a year, but even more importantly, it causes a rapid physical and mental deterioration of those patients. It places a significant burden on the family caregivers. It creates new levels of challenges for the healthcare professionals. We all know the data shows one out of every five seniors readmits within 30 days of discharge. Healthcare professionals not only see this as a challenge, but an opportunity really to shift the mindset of how we provide care to not only focus on the acute or chronic conditions, but to also focus on wellness, education, and the overall improvement of quality of life for our patients. One of the most critical pieces of the transition from hospital to home is the role that the case manager plays. Case managers really work as the bridge between patients, their families, and healthcare professionals. Their job is to look at the complex health needs of each individual aimed to address those needs. Research shows that the case manager's role in teaching the patient about what to expect when they return home will have a positive impact on their health. In addition, case managers maintain a consistent process for following up with their patients post-discharge. Post-discharge follow-ups by a case manager allows for reinforcement of education, monitoring systems, and assessing progress or even adjusting care as needed. Post-discharge follow-ups were shown to reduce returns to the hospital by 17% in those 65 years of age and older. Case managers work to navigate each patient's situation to truly understand what their current support system looks like and oftentimes seek the help of home care providers to provide any additional support for patients and families who may need support filling gaps. Case managers really see the value in making these referrals to home care providers should a patient truly need a more hands-on approach to managing things like their medications as well as various activities of everyday living. A hospitalization is really the scariest time for the patient and really what they want most is reassurance and reminders of their hospital to home care plan. A study by the American Nurses Association found that a home visit within three days of hospitalization is the most effective way to reduce readmissions. Overall, there's a three day window of opportunity that sets a senior up for success transitioning from hospital to home. If you miss that window, the senior has a one in five chance of being back in the hospital within 30 days. Case managers, doctor follow-ups, and well-trained caregivers are the most important pieces to the puzzle that can help prevent patients from returning too soon. A senior that goes home with proper support and has a smooth transition from the hospital is a senior who stays at home and reduces their likelihood of readmission. If you're interested in learning more about how we can work together to reduce hospital admissions and keep seniors at home, visit us at our Hospital to Home Care page at homecareassistance.com. Our team here at Home Care Assistance wishes you a happy case management week.